One game. That's all that stood between the BSU softball team and program history. Entering Sunday's doubleheader with Southwest Minnesota State, the Beavers were tied for their program wins record, needing to take only one game to make history. Fifth inning, Beavers up 2-0. Try to add more. Michaela Osterman rips a shot just inside the line. She'd roll into second with a double but gets stranded. Next half inning, Mustangs threatening. Taylor Chavez lays down the bunt, but Jessica Yost charges from first and gets the tag. No run scores. Next batter, Taylor Collick pops up to Brooke Phillips. And the Beavers, they escape with the inning unscathed. Still lead 2-0. Top seven now, BSU out. One out from victory. Jenna Massingill strikes out. Victoria Brooks swinging to end the game. And BSU makes history with a 2-0 victory. Then in game two, they go on to win by a 3-2 final with a walk-off double from Michaela Pagel. And during the course of the two wins over the weekend, a couple of BSU softball records were broken. The team won their 27th of the year, which I just told you, and is a new program record. And Lindsey Peterson became the team's all-time hits leader, adding to her list of records, which now totals six for her career. Here is Peterson and head coach Rick Sapinski on the records. It's just exciting to me as a player. Four years here, like I've just wanted to do my best for the team, and I guess the records feel pretty good. So <laughs> We just got two big wins there. I think we're thinking about playoffs right now, so... It hasn't sunk in for sure. It's just something we've been working for. I mean, um, you know, that was our goal, and to achieve it is amazing. And I, we said after the first game, you know, check mark on number one achievement. Now the check mark for number two is trying to get into the playoffs. So um, I know we finish one goal, we move on to the next one, but it's a great day. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.